To learn how a network works, we must first understand what a network is. A network can be as simple as two computers connected together with a network cable. Networks are used for communicating between multiple computers and devices. If you need to connect multiple computers together, you will need to go through a device called a router. The type of network that you see here is called a LAN, which stands for a local area network. A network can also include devices such as printers, so that all the computers on the network can access it. To connect all of these devices together, you will need to use an Ethernet cable, which looks like a large phone cable. Next, if you want to connect these computers to the internet, you will need to connect a modem to your network. Then you will need to connect a modem to the internet. To connect the modem to the internet, you will need an Internet Service Provider, or ISP for short. There are multiple types of ISPs that you can sign up for. The most popular are cable and DSL. These are both considered broadband connections or a high-speed internet connection. When you sign up for a local ISP, they will come out and connect you to the internet. I recommend that you get your modem through the Internet Service Provider to make things easier. I also recommend that instead of having a separate modem and router, you purchase a combo unit. You can also get one of these through your internet service provider. You can see that a combo unit makes things a lot simpler. If you have the option of picking up a modem router combo device, I highly recommend that you do it. It can save you a lot of time when dealing with network and internet issues, because one device is always easier to troubleshoot than two. So to connect to the internet, you will need at least a computer, an ethernet cable, and a modem that is provided by your internet service provider. In the next movie, we will take a look at how to connect to the internet with a wired connection.